read with me carefully and use your brain please if Allah he sent a blessing to you my friend do I need the blessing of the angels maybe it helps what help <laughs> If, I, if, <laughs> if Allah if Allah is God and he blessed me already what the angels can do more than what Allah can do because the angels can protect you as well you no know, no my like... friend the angels the angels are, are are toys in the hand of Allah they are just servants so that's it if Allah blessed me house, my friend like, you know, if, if I am God visit. if I am God and I say I protect you who can who can kill you nobody if I say I bless you who need to bless you after me nobody no because okay, because but, even when I say to you but, Listen, when you yeah. when your mother she say bless you, my son, is she really blessing mm -hmm. you? No, she is asking God to bless you, correct? All right. No, there's no man can bless anyone, and there's no angel can bless I me. If I say no, but if I say if I am the general of an army and I say I'm going to protect you, and I don't have to take the bullet for you, but my soldiers can. And so Allah, the angels are Allah's soldiers, so maybe they are used to help. You know, you my friend, like my this. friend, look at what, look what it says. This is we, we we have to focus on the word the blessing now. It's not about helping. That's it. The blessing is our blessed. The blessed is not yes. an action. It is it is an order. If Allah Allah is God, He say if you want something to be, it's going to be. That's it. There's no addition. Why is blessing? Why is blessing? Why is blessing? Huh? What is blessing? The blessing it's mean According whatever whatever you do is going to be good whatever you do your okay. life is a good life you, you will be you will so be a person you are you, you have you have uh, 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 the, the support of God that whatever you do is going to be blessed is going to be wonderful it's going to be amazing it's going to be good so that's it if Allah if Allah made a decision if Allah if yeah. Allah made let, let, let us make it simple for you if I uh, if I am a king and I decide to give you I say to you Give him all the worth. Do I need the angels or my ministers to give you the worth? Because I am the one who gave all the worth to you already. I decide the decision will not make any difference. What? What? Who are they? They work for me. So yeah. he gave him all what he needs. So what the angels would do? And look what it says here: Allahu wa malaikatahu, Allah and His angels send the blessing, which means both of them they are doing the same action in the same time, because that means that the angels and Allah are equal. And that's mean mm -hmm. that Muhammad needed both the angels and Allah, which means Allah is not enough. Same. No, maybe because the if angels just follow Allah. So if Allah is giving the blessings, the angels will follow Allah. It's no, my obvious. friend, the, the, the angels don't follow Allah. The angels obey, and that's it. Obey, it, yeah. And there's not nothing to obey here. Uh, that's it. Muhammad. So Allah is telling the angels to send blessings. No, Allah my friend, obey. how they can send the blessing if this is if he, if he blessed him already? What blessing they will send? You have a warehouse. Okay, open the warehouse and then bless him. He just blessed him. That's it. You're blessed. That's it. Uh, if Allah wants something to be, He say be, and that's it, right? So, but this is here. When Allah He mentioned that word, by the way, it's about the creation something, creating something. He say be is going to be. But now let us say, based on that, if Allah want Muhammad to be blessed and He decide to be blessed, who need the angels? And look, it's, it, the, the madness continue. It says, "Oh, who you believe, send ye blessing on him." Look, oh, it's not only the angels. It is the the believers and then and salute him with respect so look what happened now Muhammad became this Muhammad became the center of the earth and the center of the universe everybody in the universe Allah well, why is Muhammad really is a title means the most praised one right right this is, is why name, because he's God name, because he is God for the Muslims without without knowing so Muhammad now is a center Allah is here sending a blessing as you as you as, as they try to fool you with the with the blessing word. No, but I think I think maybe Muhammad became bad later in his years because he said if if Muhammad speaks a lie about Allah, Allah will cut off his aorta. And then when he died, he said this. So maybe at okay, the let end, me Allah let, let me show you how the, how that can be impossible because if Allah blessed him, Allah knew the future, don't he? Yes. Okay. He blessed somebody. He is is not. Uh, he chose somebody is wrong. He chose somebody he don't know oh, okay. Muhammad. Then if 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 if, if uh, Yahweh if Jesus is God hmm. why would he allow Muhammad to do this and lead so many the Bible says Muslims the Sun the Bible says the Sun will raise upon the evil and the and, and the good that's it you know that uh, God he allowed Satan to be exist he can destroy him so that's it you see when we say when the Bible says uh, God he even created evil who, what he meant he meant he created angel but that angel turned to be Satan but God he gave a free will oh, my friend, my friend no we don't believe in jinn there's nothing it's called jinn is this, this is one of the fabrication of Muhammad listen 
-hmm. God in Christianity, he gave you free will. This is why Satan yes. became Satan. But in Islam, no. In Islam, as you see, that when you are in the womb of your mother, he decides for you what you will be. You will be this, you will be that, you will be that, what you will be. So that's it. Male or female is the decision of Allah. Uh, 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 rich Everything or, is a decision. Yeah, but this is but this is mean Muhammad. He cannot be bad unless Allah he wanted him to be bad. Yeah. Okay. So how Allah chose him to be a prophet, and and why Allah did not say clearly that Muhammad is bad? Where he said that? No, he said, "Ask forgiveness for your sins." You fast and My friend, sins. that's that Muhammad here because Muhammad is being busted. People they say, "How this guy can be a prophet of God?" So Muhammad want to always make himself look legitimate. So could have, Allah he said to me, "Ask for this uh, for you for your forgiveness." But did Muhammad ask for forgiveness? No. Yeah, he did. No, he, he did not. No, my friend. Pray. Look what he did. This is this is a lie. This is always a lie. Do you, do you know the story of Do you know the story of the guy Muhammad? He killed him just because he prayed a lot. He wanted to kill him. No, tell me the story. What go you and get about? my book. Go and get my book and love. You will see. The, you, you will see. You will see. Of Allah? Huh? Deception of Allah. Deception yeah. of Allah. Which one? Yeah, deception of Allah. Yeah, Muhammad. Muhammad, he came. He saw. He saw the believers standing, talking. So they said, We're "Talking about what?" They said, "We are talking about a guy. He's amazing. He prays non-stop. He is the best of the believers here." Muhammad, because he's a man, because, because he's a jealous man as usual. He don't accept anyone to take his place. So he felt insecure. Ah, there's a person. There was somebody. He claimed that he is or they claim that he pray better than me and he pray more than me So what I will do I will get rid of him. So the guy he said and Muhammad he said do you claim that you are the best here? The man he said mm. by Allah I do, by Allah I do mm. And then the man he went inside the mosque to pray and then he said who wanna go and kill this guy for me? This story this guy was a Muslim. He's a Muslim. Yeah, the, the Muslim they are talking about how him how amazing he is this is a false story because why would he, a Sahaba that believes in the Prophet say, "By Allah, I do" to the Prophet? It doesn't make sense, my friend. My friend, doesn't make sense. I know it doesn't make sense. What what is make sense in Islam? Nothing makes sense. You are right, but the, but sense. this is but this is a story written by you, reported by you, witnessed by you, and given to us by you. So don't tell me it doesn't make sense. This not is what by me. This is by this yeah is by by, by the Muslims who I mean Imam not. Bukhari. Who is, who is Imam Bukhari? These are no one. Okay, my friend, my friend, this is not my problem. You are the one you tell yourself that question. Who is who is Hafs the one you get the Quran from him? You, he's no one. Hafs not he's only Hafs is a liar, Hafs he's a fraud, he's a fraud, he's a thief, he's he's everything. Yet yet you take the Quran from him. No, okay? because this Quran is all we have. We have Warsh as well. So we don't take Warsh. <laughs> Why you don't take Warsh then? I take Warsh then, isn't it? Okay, we take Warsh, but all of them they are the same garbage. I mean, it's the, <laughs> it's the same garbage, the same, the same. You know, we, we are just a change in the, my friend. We are just okay, a change in the name of the donkey. Nothing, nothing, nothing no, but more. You said, you, you said you said the Quran says a flat earth, yeah? Because in your other video, I see that. Yeah, you let us say, let oh, us okay. finish this one. We will go. We will go to the flat earth. Don't worry. Oh, oh, let us finish this one in front of us. So look here, the Muslim they decide to cover the, the cover the issue here that the angels and uh, uh, Allah and the believers, all of them, they are praying and Muhammad. They change it to send a blessing. That is what the small. The, that Tell is the most. Tell me what does this Salah mean? Salah is a prayer. That's it. Communication. No. Contact. No. 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 Salah is, is to send supplication to God. No. This is dua. Tell me, like, what does it mean, Salah? To follow closely, the literal meaning, the literal root word. It's coming from the word Salah, like you to make a connection with someone. But connection. Salah. Okay. But the second you say Salah, Salah is not about connection with anyone. It's about praying to God, as simple as that. Sorry, this is why in the Quran. I'm, I'm going to use the this, no, this is Prince. why. This is why in the Quran. Rude. Christian Prince, Christian Prince. I don't want to be rude. I'm just going to use the toilet. Two minutes, I will be back. Okay. All right. Don't don't, don't forget to don't, don't forget to don't forget to make the prayer. The Prophet he said, otherwise, otherwise, Shaitan will play with your anus. Remember that. <laughs> right. Yeah, because if you don't do it, my friend, you will stay there for ten hours, as the Prophet said. Go ahead. All right. Who's next? Are you enjoying your time, guys? This this guy will not stay long as a Muslim. You will see. He's in the way out. Yeah, that's what their prophets say to them. You know, crazy. 
أعوذ بالله من الخبث والخبائث. If you don't say that prayer, this guy he finished right away. And that was fast. Hello? Taran, Taran, hello? You finished that fast? Yeah, my toilet is uh, just next to my room. Oh, Alhamdulillah. All right. Mm. <laughs> so, now, my friend, uh, the the blessing when somebody says a blessing sending blessing that is a stupid explanation because if god blessed me and I, I do not need any blessing but let me show you something how muhammad always involve everybody in the story do you no, know because do you, you said salawat hold on hold on hold on you said salawat means connection right no salawat does not mean connection sila sila connection salah 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 mean a prayer always this is why the quran says aqimu salat aqimu aqimu establish establish contact no no establish the prayer because prayer in Islam is a special uh, uh, action uh, involve uh, 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 physical it's action in, it's in, involve it's involve no don't 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 argue with me you know I can prove it easy so if we go in the Quran it says a chapter 6 verse number 72 do you see it uh, I can't see the screen but you could read the chapter 6 for me. chapter 6 verse number 72 establish the prayer okay and this is mentioned again, you know, uh, 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 in other verses. Let us see. If we take the word salah, just to show you how wrong you are. Hmm. Chapter two, I verse like, chapter like chapter two, verse number three. Let us read together. That the Muslim translation, not mine. Who you believe, who believe in the unseen. Are steadfast in a prayer. You see, in a prayer, this is what salat mean. You can go and you this will find. This is the Muslim translation. My friend, I don't need Trump translation. I, I, I'm reading for you. What translation you like? No, because you don't agree with the Muslim translation. My These friend, my friend, I don't agree. That's why I can't because I read in Arabic. But for you, do you know Arabic? No, you know Arabic, so you okay. translate to me. I, I translate for you. Yaqimun salat establish the prayer. The prayer is not a dua. Is not tasbih. Is not uh, just uh, saying a few words you have to do certain things see the Quran mentioning the word uh, uh, Salah in a specific way so when we say hey, how do we do Salah how do we do Salah you have to stand in a certain way you have to do ablution before that you have to say certain words you have to repeat Muhammad words you have to do exactly that is Salah anything else is not Salah anything else is dua is is an uh, 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 you know asking God for your own f favor or whatever but, but, but the Quran doesn't mention how to pray Salah it just gives like okay stand bow prostrate and lie my, down no my, one lies my, friend, down. my friend this is not the problem the problem is the word salah the word salah always come as what we said establishing prayer anything else is not salah anything else is not salah it can be tasbih tasbih praise be to allah dua supplicate your own request your own you can say whatever you want that's not salah salah is you only salah, you salah is namaz this is what you're saying yeah salah is what namaz what do you mean namaz what does that mean Namaz, Namaz, Salah. Um, you know, we go to the mosque for Friday, Jummah, like this. Not necessarily. You can do it at home, but you have to do it in a certain way. You have to, you know, to do ablution, and then you do Salah. Whatever Muhammad he taught you to do. Anything else is not Salah. The five. Okay, so you're talking about. So Allah does Salah. Allah, you're telling me Allah does, and His angels do Allah, Salah. Like... Allah, He did Salah. Absolutely, Allah, uh, Allah did Salah. He so you see, <laughs> Allah, <laughs> read with me, read with me. Chapter two, verse number eighty-three. Allah, He ordered the Bani of Israel, the children of Israel, wa aqimu salat, wa atu zakat. You see, those are obligation. Dua is not obligation. Uh, salah and give charity. Yes. Yeah, this is obligation. So what is obligation in Islam? Is to do fard, fard. Salah. This is fard. The, the rest is not fard. Yes. Dua is not fard. You know, yes. but but salat is a fard. That's it. And when we, the, the second we say salat, you are the one who told me Arabic is a rich language, correct? Mm -hmm. So there's many words for the word uh, blessing. Yes, baraka. So there's no need to use the word salah. Obviously, he's speaking about salah. That's it. Allah did not so speak. Allah, so Allah is doing salah. Allah is doing salah. Angels. Muhammad is doing salah. The Muslim doing salah. The angels doing salah. Everybody doing salah. And Muhammad hijab, he says, Allah, he pray for, not pray to. Supposed he's smart. Now, yes. Now, after he needed to clarify this, he did already. He made a video uh, yeah. uh, to fix yeah, so to, to fix uh, this guy. He he uh, he tried to fix it. He made it blind. You know. Hmm. So he uh, he made a he video. Jump, yeah. <laughs> they will never get close to me.
I see speakers call are very like so I watch all of these guys and like Ali Dawa, I don't like him. He's a kid. Um my friend is a very intelligent guy. I thought he was made he, very good. He point. is not, no, he's a, he's an idiot actually. He, he you know this guy is a shame for the Muslims, and I'm glad that no, he did no, that why, debate. Why, okay, I see David Wood on YouTube. Why he doesn't attack Islam when they're debating? He was like a little mouse. Like David Wood my, was a my friend. Guy. I don't wanna. I don't wanna talk about David Wood. He did what? Mm. What? Uh, 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 David Wood. He asked him many. Listen, him? listen, listen. David Wood. He asked him many serious question. I agree, mm -hmm. David Wood. He did not do good job to put him in the corner yeah. to to you know like he get a chance to 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 destroy him immediately. But he's not a debater. David Wood is not a debater, and he is not. Yes, he is. No, he's not. He's not. No. You see, the second you see somebody keep reading from the the, the computer, always he is not a debater. You know, he have uh, something yeah. written in front of him, and he is reading from the computer. I I don't mind to read from the computer to remember not to not to make mistake about a number or something. No problem, yeah. but not to keep reading and you know looking. So he's not a debater. You have the knowledge. And yeah, yeah. No, you have knowledge. He, he have and he don't he have. This is why they debate him too. You know, he have a knowledge, but his knowledge is limited. At, at least, at least. Listen, why do you not go to debate? You listen, listen, listen. I. I I am here and he will go and uh, I, I, I allowed anyone to call me including you with my respect to you anyone yeah. can call me did I say no to you no no. did I ask you who are you no you might be a big shake you might be nothing who okay I mean I don't care so yeah. I am welcoming anyone to call me and I'm almost every day here why, why they don't call me so with the Muslims <laughs> they choose someone who don't speak Arabic in purpose who have limited knowledge in the, in Islam, so he will do the minimum damage. And the second he says something, they start making fun of him because he don't speak Arabic. Yeah, right. Yeah, that's true. And then, okay. And then that, and then that stupid idiot uh, hijab. He said to the, uh, David Wood, uh, uh, you know, like you do not need Hebrew, you do not know Arabic, as if he knew Hebrew. And then he said, Emmanuel, mean God is with us, which is a stupid. You know, uh, uh, everybody was yeah. laughing. So it does mean that. It does not mean that absolutely, you know. It, it's, sorry, I said Elijah, Elijah, Elijah. He said Elijah is the oh, same Elijah. as yeah, he said Elijah is the same as Emmanuel. So he oh, said okay. Elijah, Elijah mean God is with us, and this is stupid of him to say. So yes. uh, everybody was laughing, but uh, David would there. He did. He have a chance to to laugh at him, and, he, and he said, him, and he yeah. said, Allah is, you know. But he was speaking in respect to the person, you know. I don't know why. For me, if uh, I, Muhammad Hijab was not very respectful. He was very rude. But he was trying to be comedian. He avoid answering any question. And the Muslims. Yeah, they, they, with the Quran, I found that really annoying when he decided. To sing yeah, and he started singing and he started etc. And and, uh, and then he said uh, when he asked him why you Muslims you collect the spit of the prophet and, and you wipe yeah. your face with it, he said the. Okay, I'm, 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 what is it? This is a, yeah. this is a childish. What is the answer? Is so, it true? Is it true that the Arabs fought over the poo of the Kaaba? Yeah. The, they what? The daughter of the Prophet the Kamal did a poo poo and then the Arabs fight over it. I don't know. No, the, it, it, there is a stories about even the camel of Aisha. There's a there's a yeah, there, there's a there's a video you can watch it actually. A video movie. It's a movie made by made by Muslims send me the link, please? about Muslims. Uh, I will try to find it for you. I made a video about it actually before. Maybe you can find it. Uh, the uh, uh, Aisha she have a red camel, and when her camel piss or poo, poo after the camel move from his place the muslim they rush and they jump over the poo, poo and they fight over it and they start sniff it and put it inside their clothes mm -hmm. you know and this is aisha camel this is not even the prophet poo, -poo. Mm. you know so it's like a cult uh, uh, read with me uh, uh in chapter 33 verse uh, verse number 4 43 it says who will let you salli alaykum wa malaikatahu okay what does that mean? It is him who pray on you and his angels to do what? Read with me carefully. It says, Because look at this. If this word means blessing, I will go with the Muslim translation just to show you how stupid when they try to defend Islam, how 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 they mess it up. If we go here, Read with me. This is the most fast translation. It is He, which means who is Allah, he, uh, is who send the blessing on you, as do His angels, that He may bring you out of the depth of darkness. Look at this madness. Have you ever heard of somebody sending a blessing to someone he is in the darkness, and that may make him go out of darkness? It's like hope. 
No, but I, but no. If I if I say you are blessed, you see, isn't it the Muslim? They say if Allah wants something to be, He say be is going to be. Okay. No, no if, but it's not. It's, it's a test. Life. Like Muhammad was still. No, 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 my friend. Life. When when I say I blessed you, do do yeah. Allah bless me right now? He's blessing me. Okay. Is Jesus blessed? Is Jesus blessed? We see when we say the blessed God, because He is He is the blessing Himself. He is the exactly. blessing for the world. You but see, he, 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 he is he is killed, the blessing. He is the blessing of the world. He is not about being blessed. He is the blessing. You see, Jesus is different yeah. from anyone. Let me let me explain to you. But, Jesus is a miracle. Jesus is a miracle. God is a miracle. Jesus is the word of God. He is the word, and he's a man in the same time. Jesus is the blessing for the world. He is not the blessed. He is the when we say the blessed God, for he is the blessing. He is a source, like we say. The spring of a blessing. He is the blessing for the world. So he is a blessed, yes, because you know, he is no, the blessing. But look here, my friend. Bible, no, listen carefully. You know, in the Bible, my friend. In the Bible, it says that God is not a man. God is not a man who lie. Yeah, God is not yeah, a man. And, who and lie. we believe, we believe that God is not a man. Who told you that God is a man? Jesus, Jesus is a man. The, no, or, we, what believe, my friend, you, you see, you, the problem Muslims they don't use their brain too much. We believe that uh, God became a man, not man became God. Yeah. When you say God is not a so man, but, a man that's mean that's mean then, God is not a man. Se se secondly, when we say that God is not a man, read the, the rest of the verse. It says God is not a man who lie. So they are speaking uh, about that every man lie except God. God so never lied. God does not lie. Okay, Jesus never lied, never. But what did he said that I will come back in the time of the apostles, that I shall be with you, and all that. And he, then he didn't come, like he is with us always, my friend. You see, the Muslims they quote for us verses about the Holy Spirit, they say the comforter. Have, have you ever heard of it? Yeah, it's, okay. It's, I, I Jesus, he said clearly that I will be with you in the spirit. So, the, Jesus, we yeah. believe in the Trinity. So Jesus go, he is with us. He said, Every two of you mention my name, I will be between them, which means I will be the third. So Jesus, he is with us until the judgment day, until he come back again. Okay, so let me ask you a question. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here, what we see in the front of us that Allah is sending a blessing. May he, may he take you out of darkness. How may that can happen? If, if. How that can happen? May he. Yeah. What? 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 May. If I blessed you, is that is that a may? Okay. Okay. Let, let's let, let's make like, it simple for you. If I say to you, I, I I I I will make you healthy, and then I say, so may you come out of sickness. That's stupid. I make you healthy already. If I promise because you health, God, if said, God if I, said in the Quran he will not do any miracles. That's why God said he's not going to do no miracles for Muhammad. So he's not going to show signs. But but here the okay. what I'm trying to show you is not about a miracle. I'm sh I'm showing you if this is a blessing, how this can blessing be? This is not a blessing. Allah he he pray on you so you may God of dar darkness. It's the same as any man. This is what the word here. They translate the word salah to blessing. Are you are you getting it? Yes. It's the same. I mean, pray for you so you may know the truth. So look what happened. Why would God pray? It doesn't make sense. Why would Muhammad say that God prays on him? He knows Arabic. Muhammad is Arab, so he knows Arabic. So why would he use the same word salah? Because because blessing? because you know the the stupidity is there. I mean, should I make him smart for you? I don't know what to say. Okay. Here, Allah He sent the blessing. This is not a blessing. This is salah, and the proof of that. So you may bring out of darkness. May it's a it's a it's a wish, right? So here He made salah. I pray for you, so you may. That makes sense now, right? Yeah. Okay. Now we continue. Yeah. Yeah. If we go in the Quran in different places, just to show you that you are talking about you know uh, things does not make sense. I mean, what is in Islam makes sense? If we go in the Quran, huh? No, no, carry on. Okay, if we if we go in the Quran from the beginning of the Quran, what the first verse in the Quran? Surah Fatiha. What it says? What it says? Uh, when you open the book, you mean the physical book? Yeah. Surah Fatiha. Mm. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. No, start from the first verse. Bismillahi Rahman Rahim. Okay, who is the one who's talking? Bis in the name of Allah. Okay, how Allah, how how Allah how Allah is talking yet he says in the name of Allah. No, Bismillah is not a part of the Quran. It is what we say. We say this. This is for the Muslims to say. No, my friend. No, my friend. This is Allah talking, my friend. This is Allah talking. He did not, not say. You, no, you see in the Quran. In the Quran, when Allah he wanted to say, he said, "Qul." I can show you tons yeah. places. Okay, here he did not say it. Uh, 
This is why you see this, this, is, this is why you see some writers of the Quran they refuse to add this chapter in the Quran yeah. because this was a prayer made by Muhammad. Even Masoud said, uh, "Yeah, this." Ibn Masoud he refused to add it. Why? Muhammad yeah. here is trying to copy the prayer of Jesus, where he told, where they ask him, Jesus, how we pray. Prayer. He said, "Our Father out of heaven." And you will notice here with me, he is there's a lot on here. Is trying to say the same, huh? And then he says, "Praise be to Allah, the, the Sustainer of the world, most gracious, most merciful." Well, you just say that here. Why are you are repeating the same thing again? That's silly. Then no. he says, "Master of Judgment Day." Thee do we worship and thin aid we seek. Why Allah want to say such a thing? This. this is just a prayer. We know this. It's just you see, okay, how we go? Okay, you just say this is a prayer, right? Yeah. Okay. How you know it's a prayer? Because uh, because it's a because it's a wish. It's a wish, right? It's a wish. Yeah. It's a wish. Isn't it the same as the verse I showed you previously? May you go out of darkness. Yeah, but in the Quran, it teaches us See, no problem. No, 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 that is dua. No problem. But the one is talking here is who is Allah. Allah, Allah is speaking about his action. Allah, in the other the verse before this one, I showed you, Allah is speaking Surah about Fatiha. his action, my friend. No, when it's I said to you, no. chapter 33, verse number 43, yeah. it is he who pray on you and his angels, so you may go get out of your darkness. You remember. So here we go. The salah. I, I said to you, how you know that this is salah? Because it's a wish. Mm, it's a wish. Yes. It's, it's a, a wish. Prayer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. If Allah, prayer, if Allah, yeah. if Allah is is God, He don't make a wish. He say, "Be yes, is going to be." That's it. Mm. So this is obviously is a salah. Now, if we go in the Quran, and we try to find how 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 uh, how Muhammad present his God for us, how Allah this uh, this God he he. Uh, he function. Can you find any place for me to, to explain to me who is how does God function based on the Quran? What do you mean? Well, what do you mean how does God function? How he know? function? I mean, how he understand things? If, if we go to the creation of the Quran as an example, creation of the I'm earth not and the heaven. The Quran, do you not reflect? He tells you to be logical. Hmm. Quran is very logical. Logical. Okay, name for me one thing is logical in the Quran. Go ahead. One thing that's logical. Hmm. Just, say, one you know, just, one, just one, just one, just one. A challenge between me and you. Just one thing is logical. Mm, like, do not eat pork. Do not eat pork. Okay, that's... let me show you. Let me show you how stupid that is. Why? Because if you say to somebody, "Don't eat pork," you should explain why. Why? Chapter two, verse one seventy-three. You said you are the one who said. You are the one who said. It is logical, right? Hmm. Okay. What is the logic of saying to me, don't eat pork without telling me why? Ah, but you know, you must believe Allah. He knows for you what is good. What he knows, he knows nothing. He knows nothing. He knows nothing. We can prove he it easy. No, he knows nothing. Pork, no, my, my friend, my friend. Parasite. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you how funny the logic of Allah. Hmm. If we go in the Quran, in the beginning of the Quran, hmm. we will find this. The same we are talking about. You, you mentioned the pork. That's why I mention it. Hurrimat alaykum al mayyata wa dhamu wa lahmul khanzir. Chapter five, verse number three. Love with me. Okay. Forbidden for you food or dead meat, blood and the flesh of the flesh of a swine. Okay. He is repeating the same thing. And look what he says here. Here you will see the logic of of Allah. This day, I have perfected your religion for you. Completed my favor upon you and chosen Islam for you as religion. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a chapter five, verse number three. Okay. How Allah completed Islam for us. That's it. Islam completed by saying, "I, I, I, I forbid you from eating uh, pork." This, mm. this is Islam. Well, mm. it's not like it's in context, my friend. My friend, it's it's, it's, it's so clear in front of you. It says today. This is my translation. This is the your Muslim translation. This day, I ha have I perfected your religion for you, completed my favor upon you, and this, have it chosen Quran, for you Islam. No, it's because the people that put the Quran together, they put it in the wrong order. They don't know the order. They just didn't do anything. Thank you very much. Now, do you agree with me? If you put things in the wrong order, this is a corruption. 
I agree with you. Yes. Okay. So how the Muslim they lie to us and they say Quran is preserved? This is a new fabrication because before this wasn't the Islamic. All right, hold on. Uh, but do you have the other one? It's not fabricated. Do you have the other uh, book? Is that, the only uh, book uh, you have uh, is this one? So it's, it's fabricated. We don't have this in heaven. We don't have the right ones. Huh? We don't have the correct Quran because. Okay, so the Quran is gone. Quran. So like there's that. no Quran. There's no Quran. Secondly, yeah, no, today, yeah. this day, I have perfected your religion for you. Is something Muhammad should say at the last day of his life. Yes. This when he was on the cross, he says it's completed. That's it. It's per it's completed. It's done. Muhammad, if this if is what he said, said if he's if he said that, if Muhammad said that, he says, This day have I perfected your religion for you, completed my favor upon you. Now, if the Muslims, all of them they agree, and I showed you before that the Muslim they say, if we agree upon something, there's no way it's going to be misguidedness. How do they agree upon this? Well, you're, you're taking the argument of saying that if everyone agrees, if there's 10 people in a room and nine of them agree that uh, Muhammad no, is... No, more Muslims, all Muslims agree upon that. I never saw a Muslim who's a true believer in Islam. He say, I don't agree with it. Because no, Islam like... Islam is a blind religion. You don't you, don't, you, you have no uh, right to question. I, I gave you the verse. We, we start with it where Muhammad says, whatever the Prophet and Allah this, uh, they decide, you you take well, right Allah, okay Rasul, but, yes, but, yes. but 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 why Muhammad did not tell them how to organize the Quran why in the Muslims they have to take a Quran of did, Uthman? did Muhammad leave a Quran before he died never Us? no according to Aisha according to Aisha they have they have a, a few verses the Quran yeah. of, of Hafsa you know there nobody uh, uh, there's many stories about burning many Quran etc by Uthman but however yeah. uh, that will destroy Islam again because if the Quran is preserved as Allah he promised then the Quran oh. is burned, proving Muhammad to be false prophet. Do you oh, know, it's just a physical. No, because it, a, not only no, no. Prophet. You see, not physical because simply, do you have the other? Not, not the one is not physical. You don't have both, so it's it's gone. No, okay. So, do you remember the story of uh, of uh, of the goat who ate the Quran? Yes, the okay. Rajam and the breastfeeding. The breastfeeding and uh, yeah. So here, the Hadith confirmed to us that there is there is a goat where, while Muhammad was in his death bed mm. everybody is busy and this is makes sense you know people a man important man he dies so everybody is busy a lot of people come in and now i as she said the verse of stoning uh, uh, and the breastfeeding for an adult 10 time was revealed and the paper was with me under the my pillow when the message of allah died we were preoccupied with the with his death and a tam sheep mm. came and ate it how we can so nobody read this verse before no one memorized this verse you can do do you know it mm, no, no uh, for no, me just... to be honest with you if i know this goat is going to do that i will shoot it because i want to have this verse of a yeah. breastfeeding for adults so we can have fun me too you know me too because that would have been good because then the muslim would give us the milk mm. but now are, are you still a muslim or not i i think i am malik i reject all hadith but, mm. but you are rejecting the quran, the quran too I, I basically we don't have the Quran, so there is no Quran. Okay, so you are the Muslim. Why you don't you say I, I am out of Islam? You know, announce yourself, denounce Islam, denounce no, the stupidity. I still believe in God. You know, I still, okay, I still my friend, my friend, my Muhammad friend. Is... How you will know Muhammad is a prophet with all the stupid things he said? How how you can do that? No, because the Hadith. Okay, my friend. Lies. Name for me one thing Muhammad he said is smart. Mm, smart. You believe in the Hadith, right? Do you believe in the Hadith? I uh, no, I reject. You don't believe in the hadith. Okay, can you show me one thing Muhammad he said is a small because in order to accept Muhammad to be a prophet, will you have to have some knowledge of Muhammad? What Muhammad said to you is a smart. He said, "Be kind to your parents." You know, now, this is not new. You know, in the in the Bible, it says, "If you are if you insult your parents, you have to be killed." Even you know, this is how bad it is. You know, um, I'm sure he will say something smart. I'm just thinking like wait. like what? Like, let, let me show you. Let me show you how smart your prophet. A man who is a, were, a, a man who like is a blind. Hmm? Mm. A man who is a blind. There's a guy who wrote, he came to oh, Muhammad. Sorry, sorry. Came to Muhammad. Mm. And uh, 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 he ordered his wife to cover themselves. And they said to him, uh, blind. but he is blind. Why you want to cover herself? He said, I know he's a blind, but are you blind too? <laughs> this is a uh, this is Sahih? For sure it's Sahih. <laughs> 
Why would Muslims keep this in their books? Like for all these years, did they not uh, reject this? My friend, ask yourself the same question. Why you still believe in Muhammad I now? Reject, He's a prophet. I, re I, re I reject this hadith. No, you, no, well, but you reject this hadith, but you did not reject Muhammad yet. Why? Ask yourself the same question. There's nothing. You have nothing Maybe about him. Let's listen, listen, listen. Let's what you are doing. With my respect to you, you have nothing left of Muhammad. You said you reject the Quran. You accept the Quran. Uh, uh, the Quran is full of um, fairy tale stories and stupidity. The hadith is rejected. So what is left for you about Muhammad? What, what, your Muhammad is coming from where? Muhammad is just a messenger. He's not. This is another question. Him. Messenger about what? Where is the message? In order to accept him to be a messenger, yes. where is the message? Where we can uh, find the message of Muhammad for you? you? Take away. If you take away the man and the book, you have nothing left. My friend. You are trying to avoid, you see, you are trying to avoid to answer a question. No, no, you no said, I agree, I agree, because okay. now you have okay, so, so, so where is Muhammad for you? Why you say I still believe in Muhammad? The Sira, Sira, Sira. The Sira is more full of garbage. I mean, the Sira is the no. most, is the most horrible. The, the, the biography of Muhammad Ibn is, is Ibn Hisham, they write about Muhammad Ali. My friend, you see, Ibn Hisham, when he wrote his uh, uh, Sira, he said that mm. anything. Uh, uh, is not suitable for the prophet we take it off and now after he filter yeah. after the filter still Muhammad looks so bad so disgusting oh. so now you where you got your prophet from you want to believe in Muhammad where you want to get him from the books of Sirah is a joke full of garbage about Muhammad the book of hadith maybe is full of garbage like you know you know maybe Kufar after he died they made up bad stories about him to mislead like shaitan couldn't you know make people tell lies in the hadith this is why th th this is not my problem now you have a problem my friend you are still saying muhammad is a prophet he's a prophet okay what is a prophecy for muhammad well, a prophecy mm -hmm. in order to call somebody prophet i have you have to be a prophet in order to call you dentist you have to work in teeth what prophecy did he say mm -hmm. um yeah, let me think mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, let me make a prophecy the as Romans long as you are thinking. I would, I would, I would, gonna... let, let me tell you, by the way, I'm a prophet the too. Quran, it says the Quran, mm. the Romans are going to win the war, whatever, that mm. prophecy. The Roman is fighting with the Persian for 300 years. Yes. So correct. the war will not stop until, you know, one of them will be victorious. And look what happened. Muhammad, he yeah, said, but... Muhammad, he made a mistake. The luck is not helping him. He said, Fi Buddha is a three to nine. When you say brother, it's a it's a word mean three to nine maximum. Okay, okay. Maximum is a, is a, uh, is nine. Minimum is a three. But the Roman they did not win in 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 three to nine. It was it took them a lot longer because you see you are mentioning to me things will make will make everybody laugh. You know it's your fault. If we go to the chapter of our room, hmm. it says who's in your room. Holy Battle Room, yeah. chapter 30, verse number 2. Let us go there. Okay. Alif Lam Mim. What Alif Lam Mim? The Muslim, they say Allah knows best. Leave that one for alone. Yeah. In the land close by, but they... What do you think it means? What, hold on, Christian. What do you think Alif Lam means? Uh, we will go for that because that have to do with the numbers and details. Muhammad, he stole that from the Aramaic book, which is from the translation of Furaq ibn Nufal. We will talk about that later. The Roman Empire has been defeated, okay? And by the way, it doesn't say Roman Empire. It says a room. In the land close by, but they, even after the de this defeat in, of there, soon they will be vanquished. It's soon here is not accurate. It says, but also in a few years between nine to three, they have to put that. Within a few years, with Allah decision in the past, okay? And then when the, when the Roman, they will be uh, uh, victorious, then the the believers will rejoice. Here, here, Muhammad is doing poo-poo. Do you notice why? Well, the believers will rejoice because why? Why would the Muslims rejoice? Because if the Romans win. Thank you very much. At that yeah. moment, at that moment, Muhammad was a hypocrite, and he was claiming that he is a Nasara. Yeah. Nasara? Yeah, he was claiming to be Nasara. This why he will be. He, this why he will rejoice. What does it mean Nasara? Not Nasara, he claimed to be he, 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 he Muhammad, he understand that the word Nasara means Christian, which is false. So he thought yeah. the Roman is Nasara, and he is Nasara. So now they told him, okay, here we go. <laughs> you know, uh, the Nasara, your people, they okay, lost. What, they lost. What about the end time prophecies? 
my friend you know? uh, uh, we can answer one by one uh, your your people they lost he so he said like he was like uh, like he felt insulted okay so he oh, said oh, okay they will win Allah he just told me they will be in a few years and he used the word Buddha which means three to nine and then, okay. Yeah, and then we calculate the numbers. We will, they will find that this was a lot more than nine. So Muhammad get busted again. And in the, in the top of that, he said that in that day the believers shall rejoice. How you can rejoice? The, the, isn't it you who want to do jihad against the Roman because they are kuffar later? Yeah, but this is Allah talking. So my friend, no, no problem. Allah, Allah talking. This is make it more horrible because why the believers will rejoice for the victory of the Roman? Because they are Nasara, so they believe the Roman should win to establish Christianity in the Roman. So Empire. Allah, Allah like uh, Christianity to be established. Is yes. it Muhammad? A few years after he decided to go and attack the Roman, and he said, "Attack the Roman and get the blondie yes. girls." Yes. So how he want to kill them, and now he rejoiced for them because this man is a hypocrite. When he is in the beginning, he tried to make himself look like a Jew. So he was praying to Jerusalem. The Jews refused him. He tried to be with the Nasara. His wife, Muslim, agreed that Khadija was Nasara. So he tried, and obviously he married according to the Nasara marriage. Obviously, because Nasara will not marry a man unless he is a Nasara like them. Okay, so but they said in the hadith that Muhammad is Sabian. The hadith says that Muhammad was a Sabian. Muhammad was from yeah. Muhammad like Obama. Obama, he sit with the atheist, he make fun of the Bible, he go with the Muslims, he recite Quran. He go to Israel. He he wear the hat of the Jews. He pray in the front of the of the temple. Okay, so maybe Muhammad is just like a political leader, and he just wants. He's a scam. To... He's a scam. He's not a political leader. He's a scam. He's trying to establish his scam. As simple as that. He changed his color. He changed then, his clothes. The bent in the location. He's talking to who? You know. Why and, would he do all this? Why would he do all this? Because he's a scam. I mean, okay. you want to ask a scam? Why he's a scam? He's a scam. You know, he want to scam you. He want to fool you. But he, he's creating a whole religion to send all these people to, to disbelieve. Why? It doesn't make sense because like what benefit does he have he have all the benefit he got the women he got the money he got the glory he became a king he was no, no one they say that muhammad muhammad was poor he would dirty tie stones my friend it's a big fast. fat lie it's a big fat lie al khumsulillahi wa rasuluhu every from every attack the oh. the fifth from the attack is to muhammad let me make a little calculation for you yes yes if we have whole, we, yes hold on yes. hold on hold on hold on if we have if we have uh uh oh. Ten thousand, ten thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars. Okay, ten thousand is Muhammad. Ten thousand dollars is 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 the money the Muslims they were able to uh, steal from the Jewish uh, attack or Quraysh attack. Okay, right. If Muhammad will take the fifth, let us say there is ten thousand soldier, ten thousand fighter. Okay. If Muhammad he took the fifth, what is the fifth of ten thousand? Two thousand. Two thousand, right? Okay, two thousand to Muhammad alone. Yeah, eight thousand left over between the ten thousand army. It's not really fair. Now, but this is because if, now listen. If one, now, now, ooh, now this, if we divide the re the rest, that will be eight thousand on ten thousand people. That's right. mean each one of them he did receive less than eighty cents. Right. <laughs> Muhammad he took two thousand, you know, mm. two thousand for his pocket alone. They'll, they'll get eight, about eight hundred each or something like that. Yeah. What eight hundred? If you divide the ten thousand between, oh no, you're right. No, eight cents. Yeah, this is oh, this is stupid. This 80, is not fair. Eighty cents. They will take eighty cents each. So how they say Muhammad was poor? What is the poor? How what did he do with the money? If, but if Muhammad, my friend, what he do with the women money? The Muslim they lie to us. They say Muhammad, Aisha, she received one hundred thousand piece of gold as a gift for his her her her, her marriage, you know, uh, uh, occasion. Uh, Aisha, she insists that Muhammad, when he come to the house, only there they send the gifts. People send gifts non-stop. That's a lie. Imagine you. When it, do you accept really? Hold on, hold on. Use your logic. Wait, hold on. No, listen. Do you, use your logic. Do you think really? That Muhammad is a leader of more than a hundred thousand people, fighters, including their family, which means that we did not add the number of the family. And then Muhammad himself, he have no no food, and Muhammad himself have no money. But yet he have thirteen wives, he have tons of slaves to feed, and he have the fit from every attack. And the Muslim, he cannot even come to Muhammad without paying him in a private consultation. 
Really? Sure, the Quran says that. You don't know that? Oh, yeah, yeah. I did. Oh, yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah. You cannot, mm. you cannot meet with Muhammad. If I am Muhammad yeah, now, yeah. The, the, the meter will be charging. You know, your bill will be like, like a $2,000 already, you know? So, mm. uh, if you, if you want to meet with Muhammad, before you meet with him, Muhammad, imagine, imagine, Allah, he made yeah, a verse yeah, like why this. Would people, why would people follow him then? Why would people, if they are poor themselves? My friend, who, how, how who, who follow him? You know, the one who follow Muhammad as the gang, Sa'aliq. Have you ever heard of Sa'aliq? Yeah, the people who raided the caravans. Yeah, those are the Sa'aliq. He wrote, he wrote a letter to the, to the, to the Sa'aliq of Tuhama saying to them, yeah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh min Muhammad, etc. To the, to the Sa'aliq. If you, if you know, if you obey me, if you join me, uh, you you have my protection. If you make me your leader, Saalik, Saalik, out the outlaw. Sa like in America, they show you outlaw, a bunch of bandit uh, thieves. Yeah, Bandits. those are the one who joined Muhammad, and this is the one who scared the hell of everybody around him. And those are criminals. They are tough. This is what they do for a living. Okay. You know, if you They're have, like a if, mafia. if I, yeah, if I bring to you now, uh, uh, ten men from the Italian mafia. And we are we are fifty good men. Who is the one will scare who? Uh, yeah, the criminals. They are criminals. They they they, they don't they, they, they don't have any any ethic. So Muhammad he used them, and he you know he's about money. They 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 like that. So he told this, them. This reminds me of the jizya because I was thinking about jizya. Why do we charge the Christians and Jews for jizya? And uh, now that you tell me this, it makes sense. It's all about the money. Yeah, the, the, the jizya, I see. Muhammad, he wanted the jizya because he wanted to make money. If he cared for God, he should not allow the Christians. Man. Yeah. If I, man, if I am a prophet who is fighting kufr, how I accept mm. the Christian to worship the wrong God just by paying me money? Do Allah need money? You know? No. Yeah, that's false. Anyway, my mm. friend, I invite you to say Islam is a false religion right now, and I invite you to accept the Messiah if you wish to do so. Choose one of I them. Which I, one? I which one you want to do? Study. Which one you want to do first? I think I want to study a bit more. But don't you want to? Don't you want to denounce Islam first to say Islam is false first? I don't know because I already said like I'm iffy about the Quran and I reject the Hadith. But so you are out of Islam. So thank you very much. You are out of Islam. I'm so happy for you. Feel free <laughs> to call me anytime you want. We will give All a right. chance for more callers to call. You know. Yeah, because I wanted to talk a bit different a bit. Okay, you can text me next time if you want to talk. Okay, you can you can text me. I don't text people. I, I text yeah. you back because you okay. said to me you want to talk to me. That's why I do. All right. Okay, I'll text you. Feel free you to much. call me anytime. No problem. Thank you. Now I see I see some some Muslims in the text. They are calling us bad words. Why you don't call me, my friend? Who is the Muslim want to call me? <laughs> 